Welcome back, now Jeff, we are back with something that everyone, and I mean everyone, wanted to see. I just left about an hour and a half ago, and the building was rocking, the atmosphere just absolutely electric. Yeah, and you're talking about the slam dunk contest, yes, right? absolutely. Yeah, last year's slam dunk contest, one for the books. Yeah. We saw a lot of uh, pretty good talent. We actually yes. have a returner from last year participating yeah. this year, yeah. but a lot of high flyers making their way to town for this one. Now, for more on tonight's festivities, 47 ABC's Jonah Restuccio has more from the Civic Center. Trey and Jeff, uh, to say the slam dunk contest here at the Governor's Challenge lived up to expectations, well, uh, that would be an understatement. Six players taking part in the dunk contest this year. Jalen McCurry from Legacy Early College, Huna Kebe from Lincoln Academy, EJ Jarvis from Merritt, Royce Goodine from St. Andrews, Iverson Molinar, he's headed to Mississippi State next year from Doritos Prep, and rounding out the six, Vernon Simmons from Eagle Academy. Jalen McCurry got us started with a thunderous dunk to get the crowd on their feet, followed by Buna Kebe, a very lanky kid from Lincoln Academy out of Georgia with the windmill. EJ Jarvis, the Yale man, he put one home. Bryson Goodine, he was in this dunk contest last year. He jumped over his teammate. And then Iverson Molinar from Veritas Prep switching things up with the reverse, touching the backboard, and Vernon Simmons from Eagle Academy rounding us out. But when it was all said and done, the final two headed to the finals here at the Slam Dunk Contest. Jalen McCurry from Legacy Early College and Bryson Goodine from St. Andrews. A dunk would go for Jalen McCrary and Bryson Goodine missed his first. Jalen put home his second, so it was sudden death for Bryson. A 50 on the board would send us to sudden death, and that's what we would get. Goodine, McCrary, one dunk each. The winner crowned the bunny champion, the slam dunk champion here at the Governor's Challenge. And in the end, it would be Jalen McCrary putting home a thunderous dunk, almost ripping off the rim, if I do say so myself. Got 50s across the board. Bryson Goodine trying to jump over not one, but two of his teammates faltering and calling a quits before he hurt himself. So you're a slam dunk champion, Jalen McCrary from Legacy Early College, the six foot eight swingman from South Carolina. Here's what he had to say about his performance. No, it's my second. I lost the uh, last one in the final round. But I had my orders mixed. I did my first dunk first, but I didn't know what I was doing. And I just, this time I just decided to like pick my orders and then do be smart and like, yeah, came, it worked. Uh, I just had a lot of adrenaline in me. And I was already mad because they was, they was kind of messing up on the score, so yeah. That's my first time doing that dunk, actually. I don't know, it just happened, because I didn't know, know what I was going to do, so. I was thinking of a movement, but I wanted to get people off their feet, so I decided to do that first. At first, I was not loose at all. I was dead legs, and then, yeah. The crowd just got me hyped. And guys, this was just day three of the action. We still have one more day jam-packed full of games. And of course, you know the spot for the highlights. We'll be live here tomorrow night at 6 on 47 ABC and a complete wrap-up at 10 and 11. But until then, I'm Jonah Restuccio reporting from the Wicomico Youth and Civic Center. Trey, Jeff, back to you in the studio. What do we say? What do we say? Absolutely amazing. Bryson Godine, I was there when he jumped over uh, his teammates. His teammate had to be at least six foot five. Amazing, but how about this? Another legacy guy taking the, the title. And for a good reason. He went in between his legs like four different times <laughs> yeah. with so many different dunks. Yeah. And then the last one, it looks like he just kind of like jumped up and was just kind of like, almost brought the rim just down. Just like put yeah. it straight down. I don't yeah. even like know how some of these guys are putting on some of these dunks. But if you'd like to relive it, you are going to see all those dunks on our website again, yes. 47abc.com. Yes. So the entire slam dunk contest Amazing. up there Amazing. for you to view. Yeah. Now, so much action from day three of the Governor's Challenge. We just saw when we come back, we'll preview the final day of the tournament. Stick with us. DSI coming right back. My name is Jason Freeman. I go to King County High School. I play basketball for the Trojans. And you're watching Delmarva Sports Insider.